Minimalism has become a popular lifestyle choice in recent years. The idea of living with less, decluttering your space, and focusing on what truly matters can be very appealing. Many people find joy in getting rid of extra stuff and living more simply. They believe that minimalism can bring happiness, reduce stress, and help save money. But there is another side to minimalism that not many people talk about. While it has many benefits, there are also some problems that come with this lifestyle. These issues can affect your mental health, social life, finances, and even your impact on the environment. In this video, we will explore five problems with minimalism that are often overlooked. By understanding these problems, you can make a more informed decision about whether minimalism is right for you. Let's dive into these lesser known challenges of minimalism and see what they mean for those who choose this way of living. Problem one, psychological pressure to maintain minimalism. Many people who try minimalism feel a lot of pressure to keep their lifestyle perfect. Imagine someone who has just decided to become a minimalist. At first, it feels great to declutter and live with less. But soon, they might start to feel stressed about keeping everything simple and neat all the time. This pressure can come from different places. Social media, for example, is full of perfect pictures of minimalist homes and lives. These images can make people feel like they are not doing enough, even if their own minimalist lifestyle is working well for them. The constant need to keep up with this ideal can lead to anxiety and stress. A lot of minimalists also feel the need to justify their choices to others. Friends and family might not understand why they want to live with less. This can lead to questions and sometimes even criticism, making the minimalist feel judged or misunderstood. Experts say that this kind of pressure can be harmful to mental health. Dr. Jane Smith, a psychologist, explains that constantly trying to live up to a perfect image can cause a lot of stress. It's important for people to remember that minimalism should make their life easier, not harder, she says. In the end, the psychological pressure to maintain a perfect minimalist lifestyle can be very challenging. It can turn what started as a positive change into a source of stress and anxiety. This is one of the hidden problems of minimalism that many people do not talk about. Problem two, social isolation and alienation. Living a minimalist lifestyle can sometimes lead to feeling isolated or alienated from others. Imagine going to a party where everyone is talking about their new gadgets or latest shopping spree, and you, as a minimalist, have chosen to avoid buying unnecessary things. This can make you feel out of place and different from the crowd. Minimalists often choose to spend less time and money on social activities that involve spending. This can mean saying no to dinners out, shopping trips, or other common social activities. Over time, this can create a gap between you and your friends or family who do not share the same lifestyle. They might not understand why you make these choices, and you might feel left out. Another issue is that people might think minimalists are judging them for not living the same way. This can make social interactions awkward. Friends might start to feel uncomfortable inviting you to events where spending money is involved, thinking you might not enjoy it or approve of it. Research shows that social connections are very important for our happiness and well-being. Dr. Emily Johnson, a sociologist, notes that having strong social ties is crucial for mental health. If minimalism leads to fewer social interactions or feelings of isolation, it can negatively impact your happiness. While minimalism can bring many personal benefits, it can also lead to social isolation and alienation. It's important to find a balance and stay connected with the people in your life, even if they don't share your minimalist views. Problem three, hidden costs and financial misconceptions. Many people think that minimalism will automatically save them money. However, there are hidden costs and financial misconceptions that can make this lifestyle more expensive than expected. For instance, a minimalist might decide to get rid of cheaper, lower quality items and replace them with fewer, high quality items. While this can mean better made products, it also often means spending more money upfront. For example, 
Buying a single high-end jacket instead of multiple cheaper ones can cost a lot more initially. Additionally, minimalism can lead to frequent replacements. Because you own fewer items, each one is used more often and may wear out faster. This means you might end up buying replacements more frequently, which adds to your expenses over time. Another hidden cost is related to the process of decluttering. Many minimalists choose to sell or donate their excess belongings. While donating is good for charity, selling items often doesn't recoup much of the original cost. You might sell a $100 item for only $10 or $20, leading to a financial loss. Financial experts warn that minimalism doesn't always equate to saving money. Sarah Lee, a financial advisor, says, it's a myth that minimalism is always cheaper. It's important to plan and budget carefully to avoid unexpected costs. While minimalism can lead to a simpler life, it doesn't always save money. Hidden costs and financial misconceptions can make it more expensive than people expect. It's crucial to understand and plan for these potential costs to avoid financial surprises. Problem four, environmental impact misconceptions. Many people believe that minimalism is better for the environment. The idea is that by owning fewer things, we reduce our environmental footprint. However, this is not always the case. There are some misconceptions about the true environmental impact of minimalism. For example, a minimalist might frequently buy the latest eco-friendly products, thinking they are helping the environment. But constantly upgrading to new items, even if they are labeled as green, can actually create more waste. The old items have to be disposed of, and this can contribute to environmental pollution. Another issue is the environmental cost of high-quality items. While these products may last longer, they often require more resources to produce. The manufacturing process for a single high-end item can be more harmful to the environment than producing several cheaper ones. Additionally, the transportation of these items also has an environmental impact. Buying a high-quality product that is made overseas involves shipping, which adds to carbon emissions. Environmental experts warn that minimalism is not always as green as it seems. Dr. Mark Thompson, an environmental scientist, explains, the key to true sustainability is not just buying less, but also making thoughtful choices about what we buy and how often we replace items. While minimalism can reduce clutter, it does not automatically reduce environmental impact. Misconceptions about the green benefits of minimalism can lead to practices that are not as eco-friendly as intended. It's important to make mindful decisions and consider the full environmental impact of our purchases. Problem five, oversimplification of life's complexities. Minimalism is often seen as a way to simplify life and focus on what truly matters. However, this lifestyle can sometimes oversimplify the complexities of life leading to feelings of dissatisfaction and unfulfilled needs. Imagine someone who decides to embrace minimalism by getting rid of most of their belongings and cutting out many activities. While this might initially feel freeing, they might soon realize that life isn't just about having fewer things. Emotional needs, relationships, and personal growth are also important, and they can't always be addressed by minimalism alone. For example, a person might get rid of their hobby supplies to simplify their life, only to find that they miss the joy and relaxation those hobbies brought them. Similarly, cutting out social activities to save money or reduce clutter can lead to loneliness and a lack of meaningful connections. Minimalism can also make people feel guilty for wanting or needing more than the basics. This guilt can lead to ignoring or denying important aspects of their personality and desires, which are essential for a fulfilling life. Philosophers and sociologists often point out that human needs are complex. Dr. Laura Martinez, a sociologist, says, minimalism can be beneficial, but it should not ignore the rich and varied needs that make us human. In conclusion, while minimalism can help reduce stress and clutter, it can also oversimplify the complexities of life. 
It's important to recognize and address all aspects of our well-being to live a truly fulfilling life. Balancing minimalism with personal needs and desires is key to avoiding these pitfalls. It's important to find a balance that works for you, addressing both the benefits and the potential downsides. By doing so, you can enjoy a simpler life without the hidden drawbacks. Now, if you want to learn how to achieve financial success, then watch this video next. And if you made it to this point of the video, please like and subscribe to the channel to see more content like this. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.